What's up, everyone, and welcome back to Movie Rays. Legacies is the next big show on The CW. It's a spin-off of the series The Originals and continues the storyline from both The Originals and The Vampire Diaries. The show has been airing for three seasons, and with the third season still underway, there is a lot we don't know about how the plot will wrap up this time around. However, even though the third season hasn't officially ended, some fans are already itching to hear what season four may have to offer. Before we get started, be sure to hit that like button and ring the notification bell for more videos. Danielle Rose Russell is the star of the show, taking on the role of Hope Michelson. Hope is a young teenage orphan who always seems to be getting caught up in some sort of trouble. She comes from a very interesting upbringing and background, having been born into a family of vampires, werewolves, witches, and other mythical beings. She attends the Salvatore School for the Young and Gifted, with her character first being brought into the series in the later seasons of the originals. Hope is the main character of Legacies, and the bulk of the show revolves around Hope and her interesting group of friends and relatives. Hope may be directly related to some of the dark and mysterious beings from the original shows, but she has helped give Legacies a life of its own, setting it apart from the previous two installments in the series. The show always pays homage to both The Vampire Diaries and the originals, but it is much lighter this time around, making it more enjoyable by a larger audience of viewers. This isn't strictly because of Hope. Rather, the show was designed this way from the beginning, according to Brett Matthews, the producer. Damon Salvatore has been as generous as he can be, but he and Elena have kids of their own that they need to take care of. As the world around us continues to feel stranger and darker than ever, Legacies was designed to give viewers a bit of reprieve from the hassles of daily life. It was designed to appeal to the same fan base as the original series, but in a much more light-hearted way that can help viewers escape for a little while, yet still scratching the itch that the Vampire Diaries left behind. Brett Matthews spoke in an interview with Collider and said, The Vampire Diaries was dark and intense, and death could come knocking on your door at a moment's notice. The world was weirdly gone in that direction, so Legacies is hopeful the antidote to that. There is a bit brighterness, it is a little bit sunnier, and it is a little bit more optimistic about the world. So what can we expect from the next season of Legacies? It can be pretty difficult to say for sure since season 3 is still ongoing. We know the CW loves to throw curveballs and surprises with major plot twists that don't come around until the season finale. However, considering they have already renewed the show for a fourth season, I think we can draw a few safe conclusions about what the new season will entail. Being here, where you sent us, I've killed Kai, Diego, and Wendy thousands of times. Brett Matthews, once again, cleared up some speculation about the new season and the next season. He spoke with Entertainment Tonight about the series and says that Hope and Landon are going to be in for quite an adventure as they continue to work through countless new obstacles and challenges while doing their best to fight off the forces of evil together, rather than separately. However, the twins are now taking two different paths after Josie lost her life in season two. So what will this mean? Brett Matthews teased a few possible options. He said, Josie will go on a very interesting journey this year. Obviously, she went down a dark, violent path in season two. She will return and she will be resolving those issues and she will be resolving what she wants out of her life and figure out where she fits in at the Salvatore school and with her friends as a result of her going dark. Each of the teens and legacies may have their own personal battles to deal with, but at some point they will be all be faced with the threat of necromancer, throwing a kink in their plans and changing the course of history forever. Brett continued to say, The Necromancer, heading into Season 3, is going to make a big play that is forever going to alter our mythology. Brett wasn't clear about how much of this will take place in Season 3 and what will be saved for Season 4. At the end of the day, I'm just happy they were able to release the series without too much of a delay, considering most other television shows have now been delayed indefinitely while the studios scrambled to write and record new seasons. Why is Jade here? Yeah. I'm not the one you should be asking. So which cast members will return for the new season, and what can we expect from these characters? There hasn't been an official reveal regarding who will be returning for season 4. We really hope the CW will release some updates sooner rather than later, especially considering that they will begin filming the new season very soon. However, for the moment, we can assume that most of the main cast members will be making a comeback in the next season. The doors are locked. Brett Matthews says he has no intention of getting rid of Hope, especially considering she's the main character. Shows like Riverdale and others have often teased the idea of killing off the main character. We are looking at you, Jughead. 
but Matthews doesn't have any plans to get rid of Hope. He says that she and her journey are what keep the show moving forward. So regardless of what may seem to happen as season 3 comes to an end, it seems safe to assume that Hope will be right back at it again next year. If Hope is coming back, most fans are assuming that other lead actors like Alaric, Josie, and Lizzie will return as well. This could all obviously change if there is some sort of a major twist at the end of season 3, but for the moment, all of these guys seem to be pretty safe. Hope is obviously the lead character here, but the Saltzman family is also crucial to the plot, so it would be crazy for any of these characters to leave the show or for any of the actors to be recast for any reason. Though, with cancel culture running rampant right now, anything is possible. So I am done making excuses for you. I am done worrying about when you are going to snap. So when can we expect the new season to be released? That's a very hard question to answer. The best way to calculate when the series will return is to look back at some of the older seasons and when they premiered. Historically, the series usually premieres sometime around Halloween. The first season premiered on October 25th and the second season came back on October 10th. Considering the show still has a pretty spooky vibe and creepy energy, I think it would be safe to assume that the fourth season will be released sometime later this year, hopefully before Halloween once again. However, season 3 really threw a wrench in this operation and shook things up a little bit. Considering most Hollywood productions were delayed indefinitely, it's not surprising that season 3 was delayed for several months. Even though the previous two seasons premiered in October, season 3 didn't premiere until January of 2021. That's more than four months of a delay. Can we call your dad? Why? So he can take another bullet for you? No. Because whatever did this is not a vampire. If this is any indication, the CW may decide to keep the series on this new schedule. If they do, we probably shouldn't expect a new season until sometime in early 2022. However, the CW is always doing its best to look out for its fans and make sure they are always entertained. That's why they released a shorter season of Riverdale and brought the show back before the episodes were even finished being edited. You know there's a beacon that alerts me when someone's using. You knew you would be caught. After I found Landon, but we lost the trail and now I'm being interrogated. Looking at situations like this, it feels like a pretty safe bet to conclude that Legacy Season 4 will probably launch in the fall. It would be super strange for the series to premiere in the middle of winter or sometime around Christmas, especially considering that the entire series leans heavily into Halloween culture and the creepiness of the fall and early winter months. Thanks for watching! Be sure to hit that like button and ring the notification bell for more videos.